All right, well, Mom, you asked for a video of the house so you could see our decorations. Uh, it's a little, see, he wants to see his leash. That's what he's looking at. Uh, it's a little bit of a mess right now, you know, because we're getting ready to leave to go to Meg's. It's like 10.30 at night. We're going to leave in like 20 minutes, so it's a mess. But I'm going to show you a quick tour of the current state of the house so you can see things. The TV came in today. You can see it's pretty huge. Uh, here's the front foyer entry area. Uh, we have trash and bags ready to go for this weekend. We've cleaned this out area out almost completely. This stuff mostly goes in the attic. Dad, I keep my tools in here now because I cleaned out this space. Okay. Um, but this is actually going to eventually be like the little bar area. We have an extra mirror. I put my hooray beer guy up, but this is pretty undecorated. Here's the living room. It too is a mess. Complete and total mess. There's really no art on the walls. A little bit back there. There's the clock there. You were specifically asking about decorations. This back corner sort of a void. I actually had someone give me this. Excuse me, these are actual cells from Star Wars Episode 5 from The Empire Strikes Back and they have them framed and signed. So it's going up somewhere, but that's gonna count as art. Uh, let's go in the office. There's Christmas gifts all over the bathroom, so you can't see in there right now. I had to close that door. Um, that's the storage room, there's nothing in there. I don't know if you guys saw this, but we turned this into a closet. This used to be shelves. You know, we're gonna get rid of these wood doors eventually. This is now a closet with a door that we scavenged from upstairs. Uh, here's the office. Uh, it's really a mess because this afternoon, the new flat screen TV came in. You could see it's already mounted up to the wall and everything, so it's pretty sweet. It, uh, the only thing I have connected to it is my old school standard definition TiVo right now, but you can see I've already plugged in all the cables to, to go more. Takes a minute to turn on. You can see. You know, Shay, maybe you mean the cool. should stay over here for a little while. What are you talking about? Apparently I was watching oh, Lifetime or something. So let's get rid of that. But you can see that's there. Because of that, this is a mess and this whole office is a mess. It's gonna be reconfigured though. So that's all good. By the way, I got a certificate from the Big Lebowski. That's pretty great. Church of the Latter-day Dude. I'm an ordained minister. All right, Rigel. Rigel's hyper because he knows something's happening and he's really excited to go with. All right, let's go upstairs. You can see the decorations. We actually are in the process right this minute of getting two things of art that we got on vacation framed. So you can see the decoration in here. It's just a little bit of a mess. As you can see, we have that art there. There's a lighthouse there out of wood, but this is sort of a wood themed room. Okay, right, Rigel? Right now, this is sort of just pictures and stuff. Over here, you know, a little bit of decoration. Here's a turtle tank, he's already asleep for the night. Let's see, there's the fish. You always say you don't get to see the turtle, so he's doing good. Hey, turtle. All right, let's go in the kitchen. Here's the kitchen, there's not really any decorations in here. Dog and his housekeeping staff. Uh, these are these. That's kind of the decoration in here. It's all themed. It's just really, God, we're a mess right now. Here's the pantry. Now, there's gonna be some art down here. We've got sort of a tropical thing going on. This is our art from our honeymoon. It's an original painting. You can see the brush marks, I think. You can see where it's actually painted. The ones we just got are actually painted too. These are sort of tropical. So this is sort of a tropical area. There's Rigel up there waiting for their next part of the tour. Uh, I don't think you guys ever saw the finished bathroom. Now I'm thinking about it. This is the new bathroom. So you, first of all, you can see lighted switch, fan switch, GF, GFI outlet. Here's the mirror and the light. We're a pretty light fixture. Here's the cabinet that we did. I did all the plumbing myself. Um, you can see all back there, it's all hooked up. It's got drawers. This is a very big bathroom. This is an extremely big bathroom, to be honest. And then, here's this. We have no art in here yet. I think it's definitely on our list of things to get, but this is just big blank. We don't really have a plan. Um, I think my thing is about to tell me that I'm out of storage space on this card. It's getting ready to turn red on me. Oops. 
So we filled up on space on the memory card, so I just had to go clear it out. So back to the bathroom. We have this shelf sitting up here that was in there originally. We may put that back up, but who knows? There's a piece of little wooden art. So I think that covers the second floor. Rigel, let's go upstairs. Come on. Come here, monkey. Let's see, yeah. That's pretty good. Let's go. This is something from the trip with Andy we got framed. It's really the only other art in this hallway. Um, let's, there's this. It's Jen just random old Moulin Rouge art. This is Jen's office. You see, not really decorated. She's got her diploma. She's got some stuff, but for the most part, ooh, there's like wrapper stuff. Anyway, for the most part, that's her office. Here's the guest room. You can see it's much more civilized than when dad was here. This has some art on the wall. Jim put this picture that mom made of me up. I think mom made that. By the way, up here, you can see we put all new doors on. They're all these, they're hollow core, but they look better. All the closets are this faux six panel. You can see this was a hellacious amount of work. I just can't even express how much work that was, but I really do think it makes it look a lot better. This is the bathroom that's got the sort of Nautilus you know, nautical theme. You see that's some artwork. This isn't even hung, but it's like nautical knots. So this is sort of nautical theme, kinda, eh, I don't know, not really. Who knows? The bedroom, eventually a mirror is going up over there when we pull the mirror out of the bathroom. Other than that, we have that art. This whole wall, I'm gonna build a shelf for here, which is why there's wood, but this, this whole wall, by the way, look at this little nubbin on the ground. The doorstop, look how much precision that was. It's called thinking ahead before you put things in. How you like that? Thinking ahead before you put things in. It would have been very easy to put that in and then be like, oops, it hits the door. But this is what this wall looks like now. We think this looks very nice. We like this much better than the old ones. All right, so by the way, for that thing, the, the door in here has a much weirder clearance. And so I had to put a cookie down first. You can see that this one has like a little wood cookie I made around it, which is fine. It still clears just barely. I, I love the clearance on this. Talk about precision. Dad's proud. That's a measure twice, cut once. That's a very difficult measurement. And you look, look at that. It doesn't hit the door, hits the stopper. Beautiful. That's how you do a door. I'm very proud of the work that I've done to this upstairs. There's not really any decorations in here. And then, uh, like I said, this is gonna be a mirror when we finish redoing this bathroom. And then in here, there's not really decorating space. I mean, there's just not. It's towel racks. This mirror's gonna go, and it's gonna be put into a big, huge medicine cabinet. So, yeah, so there's really not that much up here. You know, I, it's gonna be kinda hard to do, but right now, there's a ton of stuff up in the attic. You can't really see it up there. I am gonna put a drop down staircase here. Drop down staircase is gonna go up there. We're gonna close this off completely and move the duct to this. Tear this down and get a nicer cover. For this, I'll actually show you the cover downstairs I wanna use. We're gonna get rid of that because I think it's hideous. We're gonna put the drop down staircase. Drop down staircase is gonna meet right about here and the door will extend, like the very top of the door will be right here. I was nervous about hanging it over the stairs much, but it's really not gonna be. The majority of the ladder then, if it meets right here, you'll still be able to get right up. I've measured the angle already. It's gonna come to like right about here. So it's really not so bad. So I think that closes it out. It's the last time I'm coming up here because we're getting ready to go to Meg's. So I think that's a pretty good view of the current state of decorations and such. Um, that's pretty much it. There's not really much else to show. Come here, Raj, what are you doing? Let's see. You know, all the light switches are still working and everything like that. Uh, what are you doing? He thinks he's going for a WALK, but it's gonna be much more exciting than that. He just doesn't know it yet. Oh, <laughs> in copying stuff over, I turned on a video game on the big TV. So uh, two things, one, see this vent right here? This is almost the same size as that that old hole upstairs, the, the old attic hole. And so I wanna get a vent like this for up there. I think this is much nicer. This is actually the air intake for the downstairs air handler and they're the same, they're the same, same unit. I don't know if you can see back there, but they're the exact same unit. So, 
I think that would be much nicer anyway. I guess the only thing left is you should see my cool jacket. I got this jacket at JC Penny, and I like it. This is my nice warm, look at this, it's all like wool on the inside. This is great. He thinks we're going because I put this jacket on when we walk. So he's getting all excited. But it's strange to me to be able to wear clothes that fit after being 300 pounds and losing all the weight. Now I get to wear like leather jackets like this that are nice. I love this jacket and it wasn't that expensive and I think it looks good too. I don't know what you think. But other than that, we're going to go to Meg's. I'll upload the video tonight. Have a good one.